I would like to do is go over some of the reports and graphs that are available to you. So if you go into a patient account, the first thing you'll see is you are placed on the summary tab. And basically the summary gives you some basic statistics and data. Um, scrolling down, there, there's a lot of options. You can sort by time of day, day of week. Similarly, if you want to see more of a running tally of blood glucose values or foods that have been added, those are available to you in the history section in the lower right hand corner. One of the other very important sections would be the logbook. From the logbook, which is generally the place where you can see PDM data most clearly, um, you will see that it is kind of in a graphical view and it gives you day by day of, of basal, bolus, carbs, and blood glucose values. Um, if you have any questions about the icons within the graph, I highly recommend you scroll down to the legend at the bottom. It's going to tell you what the icon for temp basal rate is, for instance, or when there was a suspend on an account. Another useful view that we have available on Gluco is this graphs section. So if we click into that, you'll see that it gives us more of a graphical rep representation of the information. You'll find a lot of the continuous glucose monitors, the CGMs of the world displayed here, and it gives us a, a better indication of long-term trends and, and data over time. Within the graphs section, there are a few subsections here, overview, overlay, and calendar, each of which give you a different representation of the data. Moving to the graphs calendar view, consolidates all data from all the sources that have been uploaded to the patient account. So BG values, pump values, CGM values, they'd all be represented here. Glucose, carbs, bolus, and basal rate display as stack graphs that allow for comparison of various data points. Once again, there is a very helpful legend at the bottom that can help you out if you have any questions. Clicking on any one section in the calendar view will actually take you to an overview of that day. This can be a great view to compare glucose, carbs, bolus, basal, and exercise data all in one easy place. Hovering over any one data point in the graph will display more information. For instance, here's a 93 blood glucose value. Insights is a place where we can view trends in common pump events, like site changes, and temp basal. And last but not least, another handy feature is this devices section. Devices allows you to kind of understand what devices have been uploaded to a patient account. So for this specific patient, you'll see there's been an Omnipod, a Simutron 600, and a Dexcom. And it also gives you data about the serial number of the device, if the time is accurate or not at the time of the upload, and even the last sync time. It's a great way to, way to see if a patient has actually successfully uploaded their device recently.